What's up Nation, Noah from Noah Nation Gaming here, back again with some Star Wars Battlefront 2 content for you guys. Today we are going to be running through how to get the Ray Milestone, the Ray Resilient uh, gear, attire, wear, whatever you want to call it, um, from Rise of Skywalker. Of course with the final update they put out a bunch of new skins um, for Ray, Darth Maul, Kylo Ren, the Emperor, uh, I believe that was it, but... This Ray one you had to actually work for, uh, just like the Darth Maul one online, you gotta get 5,000 kills. Don't know if anybody did that yet, but for this Ray one, you pretty much had to go on, uh, I, I think it was just co-op, I don't know if it's in anything else, but I did it on co-op. Um, online, play as the resistance, and you had to run through uh, pretty much some basic, not basic stuff, but just run through a couple steps. Um, like, so I had to shoot the uh, markings on the wall there, then you gotta go over to Maz's castle. You have to do this, I will say, on Tako, Tako Donna. Um, Maz's castle. There's a different version of Taco Donna in the game, but this is the one you have to do it on. Um, is Maz's castle because you actually get to go inside the castle, downstairs, and all that stuff, um, which was you know part of this Ray milestone. So took me a little bit, honestly, to figure it out. I was reading instructions as doing it, uh, which is why you're getting kind of a cut it up version here. Um, but you know, y you got to do what you got to do. It took me forever to find this uh, room with the. Uh, other side, other side, there it is, Hondo Anaka uh, painting, because um, I was just running around the castle, couldn't find my way, but it was what it was, and like I said, was, this was in the middle of a co-op game, as you're going over here, you gotta go to the three stones, and that's of course where the fight was at the time, so you know, I had to fend off and actually play the game a little bit, even though I just wanted, you know, really just got on this game, just so I can get the right milestone, but you gotta do what you gotta do, so, we got two things checked off, I believe, what is the total, five things you gotta do before you can go down to go down like the basement or whatever to the room from the force awakens and actually complete the milestone but you gotta go over there to other side turn around there you go some stones and of course this is where the fight was so you got fall back coming on the screen as well so i had to kind of do it quick but there you see you gotta hit those three stones hit the little buttons or whatever you gotta do i forget the controls um like i said i was reading an article while i was doing this to be able to find um, not, and not just fine, but know what to do, but there's one, two, three, you hear the little ding go off, and that's how you know you completed it, but next was the store, uh, wow, I can't talk, storm, wow, I can't talk, shoot, shoot, excuse me, shoot, shoot the stormtrooper flag, which is hanging right there, I just see a shot the, shot the wrong one at first, but then we move over, I, I don't know if m I was, mine was glitching, because I felt like, I didn't get the full experience, but still completed it. Like, I thought you were supposed to, well, like, look right here. You're supposed to jump on it, jump on the Stormtrooper flag, but I completely fell right down. I don't know if I still hit it at the same time, and as you can see, I, I died. Um, but <laughs> you're supposed to jump on, like, the Stormtrooper flagpole, and that's, a that's like, a complete, you know, to complete that part. I, I feel like I didn't. Maybe I did for a half a second I completed it, but I don't know if mine was glitching, because as you're going to see, I kind of just glitched into the room down here. So, I don't know, but anyways, you guys are going to see what I mean. Right there, yeah, I didn't get the whole, you know, door opening, shit like that. The door just opened, or the door didn't even just open. I just glitched into the room, and there there you go, milestone complete. So, you just had to do those couple of things, um, shoot some stuff, hit the stones, stand on the flag, shoot the flag, whatever. But, you know, I'll let you guys listen to this for a second. You can't really hear exactly what was going on, but... You can't really hear it, but I, I, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, I feel like you didn't get the full experience, like Ray and Maz. You're supposed to hear a little interaction. I feel like I didn't hear any of that, but that's why I'm thinking mine, I still did it, but it was a little glitched, but whatever. But point is, we still completed the milestone. We got the Ray Resilient skin, so that's all that really matters, you know. And like I said, I, don't, I, f I just feel like I didn't get the full experience of this. I don't know. I was watching some people's YouTube videos. I feel like other people did. I feel like it was not easy, because you gotta run around and find everything, but I feel like it was like glitching, I don't know. Maybe it's just me, maybe it did, maybe it, I, and I'm wrong, I don't know. But point is, we got it, we completed the milestone. Um, not too hard, just gotta know your way. Um, but there it is, the Ray Resilient skin. Obviously people have seen it by now, but now I got it, so happy to have it. I, I, I'll be honest, I'm probably not even gonna use it, I just wanted to complete it. I prefer this uh, Ray skin, just with the hood down, because it's pretty much the difference between this and the Ray Skywalker one, plus the yellow lightsaber, of course, but I probably won't even use this that much, but I still got it, still completed it, so it is what it is, but there's the Ray Resilient uh, Star Wars Battlefront 2 video, the kind of walkthrough from it, hope you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like if you did, subscribe to the channel, see you guys in the next one, peace!